What up, you ships? How are you guys doing today? So, it is a brisky, absolute brisky kind of day right now. It's about like 38 degrees outside, and it's, it's cold. It's cold to say, right? But the reason why I'm on here today is trying to test out all that new equipment that I showed you guys just earlier. So I'm testing it out with my GoPro right there, as you guys can see. Um, just making sure, you know, it's getting the kind of footage that I want it to get. Again, the whole intention behind it is that not always do I want to see a first person view, and I'd imagine other people don't want to see that as much. And to try and keep the attention of my own, first and foremost, and also keep the attention of other people too, is that, hey, let's come up with more dynamic range of just shooting, right? Um, the way I kind of go about my production is at the end of the day, uh, yeah, at the end of the day, it's am I happy with what I created, right? And so far I have been with every single bit of, you know, awkwardness, every single bit of weirdness, with every single bit of happiness. Um, so I'm happy with everything that I've done so far. Now I wanted to add something different in terms of getting a different angle moving forward. So I think that's just, again, going to add more dynamic videos for me, quite honestly. And then also hopefully you guys wind up enjoying it too. But I'm testing it out today, just going for a ride. I'm going to meet up with a client right now for nutrition. Um, she's a personal training client of mine. We're going to be talking about nutrition, going over that. And I thought, what better way on my way to go see my client is, hey, why not go on my motorcycle? Um, yes, like I mentioned before, it is freaking cold outside, but I have the gear for it right now. Nothing heated, but, you know, I have insulated gear, thankfully, so it's not too, too bad. Plus, I'm only going a short distance, so I'm not going far at all, nor am I going to be spending a lot of time outside. But I want to at least try out this equipment and just see what I'm working with and see if there's anything I want to change. Um, and then also get your guys' input too, if you don't mind. I'd like to kindly ask you guys, what do you think of like, you know, just having the other GoPro here? Or what are some things that you guys have done for yourselves um, that have added more uh, dynamic range to just production of videos? Or, you know, if you guys have a way of just recording stuff just for memories, if you put it up on YouTube, um, whatever it is, whatever the reasoning is, like if you guys have some tips or guidance, like please, I'm open to it. But yeah, this is how I plan on going about it, at least testing it out. I have a mount there, a Teleson mount, which I'm really happy with. I'm also trying out these new ND filters to kind of block out the sun. Um, it's not the brightest day today, but it is pretty, pretty sunny out. Um, just not warm, like I was mentioning before. So I'm definitely going to test out all this equipment today. And I'm really excited to get to use it. This is stuff that I also want to try and use on my trip um, that I have coming up the one that I've alluded to before, where it's going to be April 11th to the 17th, I think. April 11th to the 17th, if memory serves me correct. I'm not going as far as, as I had intended originally, but, you know, a week trip is something that's still good, something that I can get enjoyment, get some fulfillment out of, and just get to, you know, tour our backyard. Um, our backyard in reference to America, so why not do it? So this is all just testing out equipment before that actually starts and before I actually get to it. And you know, the other benefit of all this equipment too is, God forbid, fingers crossed now, right? Um, God forbid I get into an accident, obviously it's not gonna protect me, it's not gonna save me in any way, shape or form, but it at least, it at least is going to give you know my family some closure in terms of, okay, well, what actually happened or what went on? Was it my mistake? Was it somebody else's mistake? Whatever it is. Um, just knowing that, hey, here's the video footage behind it and what happened. Um, again, I don't want to ever have to use it in that context whatsoever, uh, but it helps. It helps. Uh, but the primary purpose, going back to the point, is just using it for video production quality and just creating different perspectives, different point of views, and just enjoying the whole process. I really, really enjoy doing video editing. It is a hobby. I don't get paid for it by any means. The only payment I ever get is the satisfaction and the smile on my face, you know, when I actually put something up and also when it's done and it's, you know, created. And more importantly for me is the whole process of doing so. So going on YouTube University and trying to figure out all the nitty gritty aspects of the editing software that I use right now 
and just learning about it from other people that have done it before me, whether they have classes for it, whether they just have videos up on YouTube, any suggestions that people have, and just trying to learn it. Because the beautiful thing about all that is that somebody once did it before you. Actually, I want to tie the analogy to reading. It's like when you read a book, um, I'm a big fan of reading. So it's like when you read a book, you are reading something that took someone probably years and years to write, whether that's you know, an intellectual read, whether that's just a comic book, whether that's just a kid's story, it does not matter what it is, but you are reading something in short of what it took someone many years to actually do, and they're summarizing it all for you within the context of 100 pages, 200, 300, 1,000, does not matter the range of pages, but they summarize all of it for you. So all those years of work that they did, research, time and effort that was spent, they kind of get to summarize it for you in that small little book, which is just like this whole YouTube thing. You know, everything that I've learned, everything that other people have learned, um, everything that I'm viewing and deciding to look at is being given to me in a very short amount of time and I'm very happy about it. So definitely gonna look forward to it and definitely going to keep doing it as much as possible because um, this is enjoyable. This is very much a hobby for me. And hopefully I can pass it on to you guys. You guys get to see the world through my eyes. Um, because I think it's pretty enjoyable. I think my eyes are pretty fun. They're brown, but I think they're pretty fun. Where are you going? There you go. Um, so just to get to show you guys the world from my eyes. But yeah. So I'll see you guys on the next one. And thank you for tuning in today. It's greatly appreciated. Ooh, Chick-fil-A. Thank <laughs> you.